little bit about this phenomenon. So um, you may know this, this is the fastest download app in the eight year history of apps. Not only that, it was actually the fastest growing product in human history. So I just want to put this in perspective. They had 500 million downloads in less than 60 days. They had 100 million active users in less than 30 days. This was literally the fastest growing product in human history. So for no other reason, please take this game seriously. 54% um, of the players have been women worldwide. 46 have been men. Um, so if you had any misconceptions about do women play, do girls play, you can put those aside. Um, this summer, people were using this game for twice as many minutes a day as they were using Facebook on their phones, um, which Facebook has previously been the absolute domination of what we use our phones for. Um, within two, 10 days, I believe it was, they had more daily users in the United States than Twitter. Think about that. Um, more installs than Tinder or Snapchat, two of the hottest mobile apps uh, currently going. They reach more installs than that. Um, in the first month. And uh, more than half of the players are over 25 years old, so it's not just a bunch of kids running around. Well, you would guess with 500 million downloads that they're not all kids. Um, so what does it look like when suddenly 500 million people wake up and they can see things in the world that are magical and they can help each other collect those wonderful things and evolve them into even more wonderful things. What does it look like? I thought I would show you a couple videos um, of what it looks like. So this is a video uh, from New York City where it's just a normal night, people walking around, um, and then somebody spots a wonderful <laughs> creature. And you realize everyone around you is playing this game, which is like you think you're in New York City and it's just a big crowded city street, but as everybody starts heading We'll see if we can. Okay, so, okay, you get the idea. Um, by the way, there are no Vaporeans around here tonight. It's all the little Rattatas and Pidgeys, I'm sorry to say. So, um, this video is even better. You take a game like this to a place like Taipei, and you get this effect on an even bigger scale. Uh, and again, I can see why some people are not excited about the enthusiasm <laughs> for which we're playing games, but I think this is very cool and very exciting. Um, because you're literally surrounded by people who are in on the secret and, you know, you didn't even know. <laughs>